Okay, question number four. We have a true three microfarad capacitor fully charged to twenty eight microcoulomb after connected to a battery. So this is capacitor three microfarad. The battery is eh, the battery. The charge is twenty eight microcoulomb. So that's the only information given, and we have to determine the energy stored in the capacitor. So for energy stored, there are three equations that you can use, but I'm going to use based on what information is given. Lah. You can either use Q, C, at or V. So now we only have Q and C, so we are going to use this equation. So this is going to be half 28 times 10 to the power of negative 6 square it divided by the value of capacitance which is 3 times 10 to the power of negative 6 which is gonna give you 1.31 times 10 to the power of negative 10 joule okay and then for question b we have to calculate the energy stored if the same capacitor had been connected to an 8 volt battery so the capacitor the capacitance will be constant lah. so the only thing changing is the value of charge so what we can do is we're going to use the equation that use the capacitance and the new voltage okay so currently we are going to use half c is the one that have been given which is 3 microfarad and v is the new volt which is 8 volt which will then give you the answer 9.6 times 10 to the power of negative 5 joule okay at the 96 micro joule so whichever suits you best but that is the solution for question number four